magota garina ku tonight we are going to see the rebranding and we're launching tonight the new battle of the drums after 15 years of existence we are going to bring about some changes that will help us to improve on our presentation will help us to improve on our marketing and will help us to make the battle of the drums a lot more exciting for all our people throughout the world, here in Belize, in Guatemala, Honduras, and wherever we have our Garifuna brothers and sisters as we continue at the Battle of the Drums in our cultural retrieval programs and, of course, building on our Garifuna culture, language, and dance. Muzina Luadame Dagoni. Iduhenyo ya lobo kubalisi yara indura yara wadima lo yara meriga lo masemu fulasu lenye ya bega rinagu arbule wa rihali iseri lani na faria ile lawe rona gararo lo ma iseri inishu gule lube watatu ni luago iseri rumule oembo wa sakri la useala wadugani Uwara, hama grigi ya sungi duheyo, gila haba fulasu, lula uloge gaga mwele, waribe le, lube wafuto ni huu arable. Laragi, kengsi room, ucha luwa sansira, gila gest, libri lebe wa dugani, luti malabiduro, mwa yura hani, rasa le, lani garifuna. And to give us an introduction into the history of the Battle of the Drums after 15 years, we invite the president of the Battle of the Drums, Secretariat, Mr. Darius Avila. Thank you, our able masters of ceremonies, Mr. Luke Palacio. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, as Luke has said, this is a very, very special night for us. But to give you a brief history of the Battle of the Drums, it ties into our Garifuna history as well. Recall that in 1797, our ancestors were banished from their ancestral homeland in Urume, St. Vincent, and dumped onto Rotan, Honduras. By 1802, our ancestors were already moving across into what was the then settlement to provide labor for the Lugwood economy of what was known as the British settlement. By 1823, we saw the largest crowd of Garinagu coming from Honduras to what was again known as the British Settlement. And that is what we celebrate at the, in the 19th day of November each year. 
We also know that by the mid-1800s to 1875, five Garifuna settlements were established on these parts in this country that we now know Belize. By 1960, a sixth was established that we know as Georgetown Village. Well, we also know that the Garinagu were able to peacefully live and enjoy their way of life for many, many years, at least up to the late 1970s. And as of then, we started to see a slow deterioration in the culture. We also experienced it in Punta Gorda Town, one of the six settlements that we knew and we know as Garifuna communities. The Battle of the Drums is a response to that deterioration that we saw that continues to seep into what we know is the Garifuna culture. And so in 2006, in response to that deterioration, a group of us got together and we decided that, you know, we needed to be the change that we need to see. And it started out with a discussion around our breakfast table. My mom and I were both lamenting as to what we were seeing in terms of the deterioration. We agreed that there needed to be that response. And what we are now seeing is that response that is brought about by the Battle of the Drums Garifuna Cultural Retrieval Initiative. Seremi. Darius Famabuga, Lubidun Bishuniwa, his story. We're very grateful to you, President Darius Avila, and um, your mom, Ma Olive, Olivia Avila Palacio, or Palacio Avila, whichever way it is said, for the vision you had at that time around your breakfast table when this whole initiative was born, and those of us here in Punta Gorda who were also very much aware of what was going on and willingly joined in that venture. And so 15 years later, tonight we are looking at moving into another level of the preservation of our Garifuna culture, of the rebranding of our logo, and of course, ensuring that the programs of activities that we have started and continue to have over these 15 years will become even better organized, where we will see better results and more fruits. We'll now hear from our president the activities we've been involved with in our Battle of the Drums over these past number of years. Mr. President. Thank you again. At the Battle of the Drums, we recognize that to be effective, we had to be, or we have to be structured in our approach to our initiative. In that regard, we have pursued this initiative under three main programs, namely our Garifuna Language Retrieval Program, our Garifuna Drumming, Dance, and Singing Program, and our Garifuna Community Support Program. Under these three programs, we have various activities throughout the year. Like I said, we started out in 2006. We are now in 2021, and 16, year, 16 years hence, we are still going strong. Some of the activities that we have pursued and maintained over the years under these programs include a Garifna Language in Schools program, a Garifna Language Drumming, Singing, and Dance After School program, an annual Garifuna Primary Schools Translation Contest, the annual High Schools Battle of the Drums, the annual Summer Camp, our annual Misurume National Contest, our annual Garifuna Children's Talent Show, and the list goes on and on. We are very, very proud about these programs and activities because we are now seeing that we are integrating 
into what is our Belizean culture, the importance that we as Garinago should be pursuing as a Garifuna nation. We'll continue and you will hear very shortly what are the new things that you can expect from the Battle of the Drums moving forward. I'm going to tell you, 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 I'm going like we said earlier tonight, we are here to rebrand and to launch the rebranding of the Battle of the Drums. And uh, our president will now tell us of the new logo that the Battle of the Drums will now carry. And when I ring a little, President Wu, Kala Iseri Wafani Dorabi, Leloni Lahuruna, Fari Lelanina, Lahuruna, Hagarong, Garinagu. Thank you again. Again, remember that our logo, as it is, is comprised of six Garifuna drums. It has represented us well over the past 15 years. It has basically embodied what we believe was what the past 15 years represented to us. However, things evolve, things change. And so we are about to unveil a new logo that in essence will replace our existing logo. And so ladies and gentlemen, we present to you our brand new logo. You will note that our new logo is comprised of two Garifuna drummers playing the Garifuna drums. You will also note that prominent in the logo are our Garifuna colors, black, white, and yellow. Likewise, you will note the year on our logo when our initiative, the Battle of the Drums, started that was in the year 2006. Likewise when we talk about the Garifuna drummers drumming remember that we started out this initiative from having the battle of the drums competition and show. So in total the logo is representative of the competition and show. But likewise, it is representative of all that is Garifuna and all that we do to retrieve and preserve our culture. Kerubai ti buka hong, nih sasi bulu leabi. Agwe leti lereng ka president bulu lau biang sasi bulu lelu beleabi lu bilit mala wabara sego bilit mala w. Guatemala, God alone, what Greek, but Greek, yeah, I'm you what by a yeah, what or do what by a la pain in law, God alone, God alone, what barriers ago. Like I said, we have new things coming, and our president will now tell us about two new initiatives that will take place to have our people all over the world participate even more in the activities of the Battle of the Drums. Of course, given the new realities that exist persons are now more and more using the world wide web and of course shopping online so mr avila will now give us the details thank you very much mr luke yes ladies and gentlemen boys and girls listen up because we 
we'll be telling you about some interesting things uh, we have started. Of course, we will continue to tell you about more interesting things at the Battle of the Drums. So, we have redesigned our website. And it has been done by none other than uh, master website de designers, BK Creative. To show us where we are and what it looks like, we present to you BK Creative. <laughs> Thank you for the amazing introduction, Mr. Avila. Biti Guyo ni Duheyo, Mabrigo, Battle of the Drums Nation stand up. Tonight is truly historical. Our developers have been working tirelessly to bring you what can only be described as multimedia innovation. So it's with extreme pleasure that we present to you the new Battle of the Drums website. Naturally, our new website boasts cultural colors, but the site is way more than just visually stunning. The new Battle of the Drums website comes with a ton of features. Like most modern day websites, the new Battle of the Drum website is fully responsive, meaning that it is optimized to fit almost any device across platforms and browsers. We have also simplified how the site functions. Everything can be easily navigated to from the home page. Our sticky menu feature also ensures that it is easy to go from page to page on the site. The new website is the Battle of the Jumps Virtual Resource Center. All information about the Battle of the Drums can be found here. Its history, the founding members, the active members, past competition winners, and so much more. Keeping in line with information, the website also features a live calendar over on the events page that you can easily add upcoming events to your own calendars. You can literally mark the date. Navigating over to the news on the menu takes you to our blog. The Battle of the Drums blog features all the updates, press releases, and other changing information about the Battle of the Drums. As it relates to sponsorship and donations, the Battle of the Drums is moving away from GoFundMe. The website now has its own donation platform built in to promote transparency, each activity has its own donation form along with activity information and a yearly goal, making it easy for supporters to donate to their favorite activity and to help keep the initiative going. Finally, as a present to all of those who come to our site, we have a fixed music player so you can enjoy original Garfuna music as you browse the site. Some tracks can only be found here on this site. So log on, press play, and start staying up to date with everything Battle of the Drums.
So you have just seen our website masterly designed and crafted by BK Creative. BK Creative have also assisted us to go a notch higher. And how is that? On our website itself, you can access our brand new online store, the Battle of the Drums online store. You see this t-shirt? Well, this is only one of the many products that you will find on that store. So you will notice that the Battle of the Drums is now going e-commerce. Again, recall that all the proceeds from whatever income stream or income generating activities that we pursue are channeled back into our Garifuna Cultural Retrieval and Preservation Initiative. So we encourage you to continue to support us in every way that you can. Visit our online store and to hear more about it, here again is BK Creative. Thank you for the kind introduction once again, Mr. Avila. I know you have seen the new logo and how Mr. Avila magically put the new never before seen logo on his shirt, but we know the secret behind his little trick. And because you have been so kind to tune in, we will share it with you. He went to the Battle of the Drums online store. You can scroll all the way to the bottom of the homepage or simply press the shop option on the menu and it will take you to the brand new Battle of the Drums online store. The online store is filled with Battle of the Drums and other high quality Garifuna merchandise. The online store works just like most other online experiences. First, simply look for the apparel you like. Second, add it to your cart. Add a few more things if you'd like, for example, this Battle of the Drums dad hat. Three, hit checkout. Four, enter your billing and shipping information. And finally, look fresh. All checkouts are done through PayPal, and also all prices are in USD. See, it's as easy as that. Be sure to go and get your merch to show your support for the Battle of the Drums. So yes, e-commerce ready, Battle of the Drums. Thank you, BK Creative. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, you have seen all the good things that we have been doing and that we continue to do. You can depend on us to continue to carry the Garifuna culture to a high level. Everything you have seen and all that we are showing you, I'm sure you will agree, is cause for celebration. So we invite you to come and celebrate with us. And what better way to celebrate than to have a nice, lively Garifuna concert. So, join us in our Battle of the Drums 2021 Summerfest. Over to you, Ralph. <laughs> 